It's Tipsy Tuesday at 383 Design Studio. Join our digital design guru for today's Adobe for Fashion quick tip. It's been a while, right? I know, I know. But we are back and today we've got a tip for my lingerie designers. And since the lingerie sketching class is our first of the year, I thought I would dedicate this week's quick tip to lace and recoloring it in Photoshop. So let's get started. Start by scanning your lace and opening it in Photoshop. Black against white or white lace against the black background is always easiest. But if your lace is a color, just make sure the background is a good contrast color so you can easily isolate one from the other. If needed, play with some of your settings to clean up your scan and get better detail. I like to use levels from the adjustments panel to get rid of extra dirt and balance some of the highs and lows in the scan. You may also want to remove the background and make it transparent so it can easily be used later on in a sketch. Next. Change the image mode to grayscale and say OK to discard color information. Then go back to the image menu, mode, and choose duotone. Despite the title of the function, the option will default to monotone, but this is fine because it's exactly what you want. From here, you can color this lace whatever color you want it to be. Click the solid black swatch and the color picker appears. Choose or mix your color and your lace is instantly recolored. Type a name and press OK. Save this file and you can recolor the lace over and over by going back to the duotone menu and specifying a new color. This technique works great if you're coloring flats or hand drawings in Photoshop. You can even bring this into Illustrator if you wanted to. Simple to recolor and simple to use. Just copy and paste the lace and add it to a sketch. And that's today's quick tip. Subscribe to our channel to keep seeing new digital fashion videos and email us or leave suggestions in the comments for our next quick tip. Have a fabulous week and I'll see you on 7th Avenue.